all right the question here say factorize or factor c square minus 8c minus 20. now if you check the coefficient of c square here is one so this is one c square so when you have a case like this a very simple way of factoring this will be to open brackets up like this and then put in c in the brackets as shown here now the next thing is to find two factors such that when you multiply them it's going to give you negative 20 and then when you add them it's going to give you negative 8 that means two factors of 20. now in order to get that factor the challenge that most students usually face is how to get the factors of 20 especially when you have larger numbers here so a simple way of doing that of getting factors is to break this last number here into product of its prime factors so now 20 can divide 2 as the smallest number 20 divided by 2 is going to give you 10 then 10 can divide 2 10 divided 2 will give you 5 and then 5 can divide 5 and then you get 1 so the factors of 20 are 20 times 1 that is 20 and 1 10 times 2 will give you 20 so 10 and 2 and then 5 times 4 will give you 20 so 5 and 4 so we have 20 and 1 10 and 2 5 and 4 as the factors so which of these pairs of factors will give you 8 now so if you check 20 and 1 cannot give you 8 5 and 4 cannot give you 8 but 10 and 2 can give us 8 so what do you do we have we need negative 8 so we are going to take negative 10 and positive 2 so negative 10 added to positive 2 will give us negative 8 so that means the factors of 20 that will give us that when you multiply them is give you negative 20 and when you add them give you negative 8 are negative 10 and positive 2 so what you just need to do is to come back to that bracket that was open initially and then you add the negative 8 i mean the negative 10 and the positive 2 and that gives you the final answer so factoring this we give you this as the final answer so that is the trick that you need to apply in cases like this so please subscribe to this channel so that you can get more important lessons from the content of my textbook explained to you from chapter to chapter so please subscribe to get the full content of this textbook thank you